Hello Capricorn, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Capricorn, this is your reading for the month of July and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Capricorn, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. Look, there is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in the description box and comments section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is a likely con conclusion between you and this person. Okay? Uh, what else? Yeah, as far as this reading on YouTube is concerned, we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you're thinking about, you're dealing with, or you will be dealing with. So let's get started now. I will shuffle the cards. I will lay them down. And then we will discuss the energies. All right. Okay. So what is your energy, Capricorn? We have World Card. Nice. We have Empress. Wow. And we have Page of Cups energy of your person queen of pentacles then we have four of pentacles and we have knight of pentacles you may be dealing with a libra you may be dealing with leo taurus aquarius scorpio if the sign pops up all the better let's not remain fixed on the signs you may be seeing a lot of zero zeros Capricorn, World, Empress, and Page of Cups. You are on a journey, whether you know that or you don't know that. Uh, some of you are aware that you are on a spiritual journey some of you are not aware that you are on a spiritual journey i mean subconsciously everyone is aware but consciously few of them are aware few of them are not okay and the journey is about embracing authenticity this journey is about accepting who you are this journey is about accepting who you are becoming. This journey is about not feeling apologetic about who you are. Not feeling guilty about who you are. Okay. Becoming highly self-aware and consequently becoming highly confident. Okay. This journey is about self-discovery. But how? With the help of spirituality. Okay, so when I say with the help of spirituality means what? You're peeling off your layers. Okay, you are trying to reach the core. And either by either universe is putting you into certain situations. You're experiencing those situations. You're having certain realizations about yourself. And you're proceeding to the next situation. Or probably you're making some conscious efforts to know yourself. Maybe you're doing meditation. Maybe you're you're doing some yoga that is helping you re reach the core within. Okay. That is helping you know yourself. That is helping you balance out, structure out your, your chakras, seven chakras okay that is helping you understand what is the right way to think and to act and to implement as a result of this you acting like a good boy or a good girl like you have become a special child in the world of spirituality you have become very close to the universe and as a result of everything as a result of 
you understanding yourself well as a result of things becoming very clear to you in your life okay you are either you're going to experience a lot of abundance or you're already experiencing abundance okay automatically the negative energies will be thrown out of your life like you will literally see people and situations being pulled out of your life and all of a sudden someday get someone gets vanished all of a sudden someone on their own they they step away from your life on their own they think that the negative energies they think that they are unnecessarily messing around with you and they are committing a mistake by messing around with you so negative energies or unnecessary things and situations and people are getting removed from your life okay and you are not even understanding how these people or these situations are falling out of your life okay and how your path to your destiny or to your life purpose is becoming so smooth and so clear so when i say abundance is coming your way abundance in, in what form okay so it depends upon what exactly you are manifesting what what will make you really happy some of you are manifesting love okay some of you are manifesting financial stability some of you are manifesting almost everything you want love your financial stability you want to have a family you want to meet a uh, you, you want to meet your spiritual tribe soul tribe you're manifesting everything whatever whatever you're manifesting right now whatever is going to make you happy right now you're manifesting that if you're manifesting happiness and satisfaction that is coming your way if you're manifesting wonderful relationships wonderful friendships romantic relationships long lasting romantic relationships that is coming your way if you're manifesting money okay so this energy of empress is someone who is very abundant someone who is very satisfied in their life someone who is content with the way life is progressing okay and that's what i see and capricorn you know what first of all once you start getting into this energy of empress there will be so many who are going to become interested in you okay but you will know whom to entertain and whom not to entertain queen of pentacles five of sorry four of pentacles and knight of pentacles so whoever this person is this person is probably a combination of air and earth okay taurus virgo capricorn gemini libra aquarius so whosoever this next person is they are going to give you much needed emotional stability that you're looking out for that you're looking out in any romantic relationship okay there is going to be lot of satisfaction lot, a lot of contentment in this connection this relationship will happen slowly and steadily but surely okay this person they they like to take their own time they like to know their partner they like to spend a lot of time before they get into a sexual act so don't think like oh this person do they really like me or not or they are just doing some sort of a time pass with me okay uh because that is what i'm feeling with queen of pentacles and uh four of pentacles like you may reach a point where you may start thinking like this person is not 
serious with me because they are taking too much time but that is not the case they have their way i mean they have their they 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 become physically close only when they they are comfortable only when they think that they have known the other person enough and i'm not saying that you are looking out for physical connection instantly in a relationship but that is what you have experienced in the past and that is what with that thought process itself you're going to head in this relationship as well but the things are going to be a bit different over here okay uh at the same time what i see is like you are going to you're going to travel a lot with this person yes you guys will travel a lot together you guys are going to have some expensive vacations i'm getting a lot of abundant energy over here in your energy also and this person's energy as well both of you are coming across as very abundant people okay so you may meet this person at workplace or through work there is a connection of work over here like work is going to act as a catalyst for you guys okay or you guys may even meet while traveling what are you sad about i'm getting attracted towards queen of pentacles and four of pentacles like there is so much of happiness and abundance but there is something that it's not that you're going to be sad in this connection but maybe you're going to have lot of self doubt look what is going to happen is you never had a connection where you experienced true love you never had a connection where someone has showered you with so much of gifts and someone has showered or someone did spend so much of money on you or someone has given so much of unconditional love to you so maybe you're going to take some time to believe like this is happening for real okay but this is going to happen this person is going to shower you with lot of love and care and also some expensive gifts <laughs> and maybe some expensive vacations as well so don't worry this person is coming with lot of genuine intentions okay all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below the link for the extended is in the description box and comment section we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care of yourself and have a great time ahead bye bye